We are going to select uh, Robbie Robinson from Texas. Well done. I chose Clemson because uh, the first time I stepped on campus, um, I was absolutely sold. Everything here is so beautiful. Uh, the people here are so hospitable and wonderful, and just the program itself was undeniably great. I would just say the facilities are, are just fantastic. I mean, we're coming in, and Jervy, the complex, is, is awesome, and knowing that we have another complex coming in September that we get to move into is unparalleled and I'm, I'm extremely excited about it. Hey Tiger fans, my name is Lindsay Ricketts and I'm the academic advisor for the men's soccer team. One thing to know is how important academics is to this team. One of their core values, number one, is emphasize education and that is something that is done day in and day out with this program. We have great support from the coaches that really help us from the top lay down the line of how things are gonna work and the guys do great academically. We've set a number of GPA records. We maintain above a 3.0 average most every semester, which is a pretty big accomplishment. And we have many, many guys on honor roll each and every semester even some with 4.0s. So we have a lot to be proud of here at Clemson. My favorite part about working with the men's soccer team has to be that adversity on the team. It's really fun and very interesting for the small town girl to see people from all over the world come to Clemson to get their education. So I learn from them just as much as they can learn from us. As a two-time alumni of Clemson, it's pretty cool to get to come to campus every day and to also help other students be able to earn their degrees and achieve their goals of becoming a college graduate. Probably my biggest memory with the team would have to be the ACC championship game when we won a very, very last minute with only seconds on the clock and it was definitely a night to remember.
Uh, Miles Joseph. I'm uh, an assistant coach with uh, the Portland Timbers, also a Clemson alum. The culture of, of Clemson just in general, the people that are there. Like I haven't uh, been back in a couple of years because of our schedule, but if I went back now, you would meet certain people that are still working there that were there when you were there and would remember you. And it just has this, this family like culture, you know, like we see, I see people here in Portland with the Clemson Tiger, you know, the Tiger Paw. And I'm like, go Tigers. And they go Tigers and they'll come over and, you know, they'll, they'll, we'll like, we'll have engage in this conversation. And everywhere I've been, Orlando, uh, New York City, Salt Lake, every, everywhere you go, you see the, the Tiger Paw. And to be a part of that family is, is amazing. And, and the soccer culture too. I was there when Ibrahim was there. I know Mike Noonan really well. And you know, what Mike has done with this program over the years has been incredible. You know, I really admire the work that he's put into it and, and the culture that he's created around the soccer team. It's really something special that he has. And, and obviously um, Phil and Camilo, you know, they're a big part of that culture too. So I'm really proud of those guys. I'm proud to be a Tiger with those guys being the leaders of the um, soccer program. The exciting games were obviously the run that we had. My senior year, uh, we ended up losing to SMU. That was a fun run. But I would say the most memorable for me would be when we beat Wake Forest on our home field to win the ACC outright regular season, because I feel like that's that's equivalent to the supporter shield. You know, so I, I, uh, I would probably have to say when we won against Wake Forest on our, on our home field uh, was, was a great year. When Coach Noonan came to me and said, hey, you know, we have this program, we want you to graduate. And I was like, I'm in whatever it takes. You know, the professors there, like I said, are just, it's like a family. I mean, it's a great program for individuals that are in my situation. And, you know, I couldn't be more proud of you know, finishing that degree and, and being a graduate from Clemson.